Hello everybody, this is Jeremy and Danny with The Boathouse. Today we're going to do another episode of Electronics 101. Today we're going to talk a little bit about the digital switching by Optimus. Um, it's new to a lot of the boats in the market. Something real cool about it is it gives you a really nice clean dash and you know just gives you that great display with your nice large screens. You don't have any of the switching standing out. So all you got to do is go into a switching page within your GPS units and it's all right there, easily accessible, nice and clean looking. But on the flip side, one of the complaints we hear every once in a while is, what happens if my electronics go out? Do I lose my switching? The answer is no to that. You do have an override, and we are gonna show you that today. But as you can see right here, we've got all of our different underwater lighting, hard top, deck lights, pumps, you know, everything is all right here. So, you know, if you want to turn on your hardtop LEDs, you've got your blue LEDs on the boat overhead. Now, let's say for some reason your electronics did go out and you wanted to want to either turn them off if it was night time and you're trying to run and you don't want to see them. Obviously, you can turn them off there, but if your screens have gone bad, you won't be able to do so. So, what I'm going to show you today is how to manually override that. Down below here. As you see, you've got this Maximus DCM by Seastar. What that is, is all of your switches that you see on that panel, right here. So for instance, like we were just talking about the hardtop lights. You find hardtop lights right there. You go down to your fuse down below. If you pull it out, as you can see, there's actually three pins inside of there. If you're having it set up to be on your switching up above, that you'll be on the top two pins. If you wanted to manually override that and turn it on, you just go ahead and put it in the bottom two pins and now your LED overhead lights are gonna be on. And then for whatever reason, you wanna either turn it back off or flip it back on to the you know, screens controlling it, just go ahead and move it back into that top position. What that really is, is just more of like a manual override for emergency situations or if your screen goes go down. So if you need to turn on some type of pump, if you want to turn on your bilge pumps or a live well pump on or off, or you know fresh water wash down, whatever the case may be, you do have the ability to override those screens. So just a nice, clean, easy display. Um, just like I said, in case those emergencies, if you need to you know, flip that over. So just wanted to give you that information on that. If you do have any questions on any of the electronics, feel free to reach out to any one of us here at the Boathouse, um, or come on, stop by and check us out. Visit us on our website at www.boathouseh2o.com or just give us a call. We look forward to seeing you soon. Thanks.